I trust Limbo have been warning you people for years that our culture of sin and entitlement would lead to God striking us down. And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. Somebody get me the hell out of here now! Now, goddammit, do I pay all those taxes? That's not very professional. Oh, it even did the little did 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 through the radio. That's cool. Message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Max, it's, it's Nathan. I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody used me. <laughs> Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit will be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. I'm sorry. He's trying to warn us. I thought he was... He must have said that before he died? To be fair, we only have, um... Jefferson's word that Nathan's dead. We haven't seen it, but... So we ended up going with the option to leave Jefferson alive, to rot in prison and have a really terrible time. some of these people though I don't wanna die here. okay no. I hear you that guy is trapped I have to help everybody I can thanks kid are you okay once I get the hell out of here I've been hauling loads for way too long in this shit old town you better go now and I ain't never coming back you need a lift no thanks I have to find a friend you go girl you go Sounds like Madsen. Oh. Death is everywhere. Following me. Whoa. Whoa. from getting hurt was there anybody over here yeah we had these people come here nope I don't want to go there okay I just wanted to see if they were okay Here. See that tornado? Get the hell out of this here! Is the end. There's no way I can it's pass up these now. images. Just look at it. You can't take no, Evan, seriously. Head. Now move your ass. Okay, if you insist. Whoa, Max! You do know things. I'm such an idiot. Only yeah, you bro, get the f out. Until this blows over. Okay. Now I better listen to the real everyday hero. Come with me. I have to help somebody else first. Okay, 
okay, I'm gonna try. Oh, I can't stand seeing these bodies. You need to leave. Okay, we're going into the entrance. I don't think I can help her. She's not, uh... You're not dead! You're not! Let's see if somehow... Oh my god, Evan. Robert, Evan, did you see that Get the hell out of here. Max, there's no way I can pass up these images. Just look at it. You can't take a picture when you're dead. Now move your ass, okay? Okay, I don't think I can save the already dead people. And she is not interested. What about these people? No, they're okay. We're good. I really don't think you should be out here. Is there a way that we can... Let's see. No, he's dead. There's nothing I can do for him. But now, we went back so far that I think the guy by the truck is still here. I think that's all we can save. There's the dead body, but there's nothing we can do just by looking at it. Hey, wait, we have somebody over here. Hey, that's, uh... What's her name? I want to say it's, like, Alyssa. Shit. Alyssa needs help again. Yeah, it is. Help me get down! Somebody help me! I'm coming, I'm coming. Jump over. Alyssa, are you okay? Let me help you down. Fuck that shit, Max. Whenever you show up, I have to get out of the way. You'll just get... Ah! No! Uh... Alyssa, are you okay? Let me help you down. Fuck that shit, Max. Whenever you show up, I have to get out of the way. Don't just get... Ah! No! Are you freaking kidding me? Help me get down, Max. Okay, is there a better way of doing this? I'm stuck up here. Oh, here we go. Get inside. Now I am. We need to get out of here. Alyssa, you go on. I have to help other people. I 
feel like this girl, I don't know how to help her. This girl's on her own, I guess. How can I get out of here? If we can make it out of this, Chloe. This makes me so sad. Damn. Okay. I just need to switch on the electricity to activate the sprinkler. Okay, let's do it. Whoa! He's dead. Let's not do that. I want to help that fisherman, but he's in shock and he might not hear me. Well, can we try? Maybe I can throw something through there? I want to help that fisherman, but he's in shock and might not hear me. Do I really want to sacrifice him? I mean, doesn't seem like we have a lot of options. Okay, let's see if we... Oh, I know what we can do. Let's do this. Then can we go around and save him? I go here. This doesn't really help his scenario. But how can I even save him is the question. I don't even think we can save him. Oh God, I should have stayed inside the room. What have I done? Oh, that was a bad idea. I don't think we can go back in. Nope, shit. Oh god, I just realized it's way too late. Bad mistake. Whoa. Whoa! Are actually the people here. Look at that. This tornado. 
might be the end of the world. But not if I can change it. Damn, this is blocked off. Now I have to find another way into the diner. Going around. Once we get the photo, doesn't all of this, uh, you know, not totally matter? I should have warned her. Oh I never no! Even Once again, this is not a test. This is not a test. An E6 tornado. At least nobody's going to starve in here. And surrounding counties. The emergency broadcast system is now in effect. Trust me, I'm trying to figure out how. I swear. Max. Oh, Max. Oh. Jesus, I am so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Yes. What about you guys? Two whales is barely standing now. I don't know if it's gonna make it through this tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out I know. there. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce, but it's all we have. You okay, Warren? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about well, it. Well, it's kind of tough to so assume stupid. what's gonna happen. Should have seen it coming. Hold so on. glad everybody is safe here. Um, but I need that photo from Warren to help Chloe. Sorry, sorry. Oh, no. look, it's Frank. Okay, Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. Frank, I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, it makes two of us. Now, if only I had Rachel back. Now, Max, what about that info I gave you? Did you and Chloe find out what happened to her? Uh... Do I really need to make him feel any worse right now? I'm sorry. We had no time to investigate when the storm started. Well, then there's still hope. Look, I need a rest now. I'm wiped out, like Arcadia Bay. I just hope Rachel's far away, playing in the sun, happy. Thanks for trying, Max. So I guess we just wait for the Lord to lift us up, or not. Let's see what happens if we tell him. Sorry. No, no. Okay, Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. Frank. Yeah, makes two. Now, Max, what a. Oh, Frank. I don't know how to say this, so I just will. Rachel is dead. Yeah, no, please. Please, no, no, not Rachel. She can't fucking be. Are you, are, you, are you sure? I mean, how do you know? We used the names you gave us to track down a farmhouse. My professor, Mark Jefferson, has this creepy photo torture room. And we found out he was using Nathan Prescott to drug and photograph Blackwell students. Prescott? Fuck! Fuck, I knew it! I should never have hooked up with that sick punk! Papadou hated him! You saw... You saw Rachel. I don't know what to tell him! No, I didn't. But... Nathan wanted to impress Jefferson, and I know he... killed her. How? How did he kill her? I mean, we've already gone this far. He used some drug and gave her an overdose. An overdose? The only way Nathan could have done that is, is if I sold it to him. 
I killed my lioness. Oh, he's gonna lose it. No. What have I done? Where is this motherfucker Jefferson? He's going to jail. He won't be hurting anybody anymore. Rachel. Oh, no. God. She was the one good thing in my life, Max. I know she was too young. I expect her to leave me. Just... It's not how it happened. I would never have stopped her from going after her dreams. I know. She obviously cared about you, Frank. Rachel cared about a lot of people. Especially Chloe. But, uh... Now I see why Rachel dug her. And Chloe was man enough to ask me for help after all that shit we went through. Chloe would appreciate that. You know, the one time I met my dad, the bastard quoted the Bible and said he wanted to enter his house justified. In other words, to do the right thing. Me too. And maybe you're helping me get there, Max. Don't get me wrong, kid. I still think you're weird. But you're cool. I feel good about how this has gone. I think we're gonna leave it like that. Come on, Max. Let's talk over here and give Frank some rest and space. Joyce, how are you doing? Just when I think I've already been through the ringer. Where's Chloe? Oh my god. Um, let's be She's cool. safe, Joyce. She just sent me a text before my phone died. Oh, thank God. I was torturing myself before you showed up. Oh, God, if something happened to Chloe while well, I ended up stuck at this diner again. I'm sorry about all this, Joyce. Don't be, honey. It's not like you whipped up this tornado on your own. Um, well, I mean... I'm also sorry about everything with David. You don't have control over any of that. David is an adult, and he has a lot more age and experience under his belt. I feel like in certain situations it's okay to lie like this. Um, telling her she's dead, right? Like, we need her to be... She needs to be focused, right? Like, there's a lot going on right now. Worrying about somebody else that she... Literally nothing that she can do doesn't help with anything. I'm sorry I caused so many problems with David and Chloe. You did the right thing. David overstepped his bounds. I had a suspicion he was taking his private surveillance way too seriously. But he's sorry. And I wish he was here right now. I just want our lives to be normal again. With all the shit going on this week, I think you're right. And look at me, trying to keep my family together. Max, did I make a mistake kicking David out? Um, shit. Oh my god. Why am I the have to be, like, why do I have to be the problem solver here? I think, I do think it's her choice. David does need her. Both are viable options. He is kind of a dick. But like, she's asking advice of like, <laughs> a teenager. Um. David saved call. my life from the storm. He means well, even if he doesn't know how to show it. But this has to be your choice. I'm so happy David was there for you, but I don't always like his attitude either. Sometimes, he scares me. Is this the best time to have to this conversation? I'm used to my life being hard. Chloe had to find out way too early. And I, I don't think we need David around to keep reminding us. You're right, Max. I think I'm making my choice now. Uh oh. 
mean, the guy did save our life. We're gonna tell him, or we're gonna tell her I that just... David needs her. David See saved my life from the storm. I saw how much he cares about Chloe, even if he couldn't show it. David needs you more than ever, and I can see why you love him. I'm so happy David was there for you. He has a lot of weight on his back from the war, but he truly wants to help people. He even agreed to take a family counseling class. He I'm said that sure same that thing. was a hard thing for him to do. It shows how much he truly cares about you and Chloe. Nothing would make me happier than for David and Chloe to make peace, not war. But I don't know what to do anymore. I just... I just want this storm to blow over forever. Maybe it's time we leave Arcadia Bay. If we can. David is a real hero, Joyce. I know that all he wants to do is make you happy. I know he would do anything for you. And Chloe. I know. And yes, he's not William, but that's okay. He's not supposed to be. You reminded me of when he came into my life. I was ready to give up. David's love gave me strength. He even told me I was his hero. I can't give up loving him. I want him to come back okay. home. Okay, I feel good about this. Oh, I hope I get to tell him that I've soon. got the warm and tinglies. I can't seem to escape the two whales. Good job, Warren. I hope those supplies are enough. Just about to drive to Los Angeles, too. What about this other guy back here? I guess... He's just there. Right. At least Frank still has Pompidou at his side. I hate to say I'm glad to see you, but I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. Damn, Max. Can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be hard Finally to explain. Finally tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. <laughs> then I found out that I could rewind time. And Where else could I be? Long story short, Mark <laughs> Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? Oh god, should we lay it on him? He's gonna crumble. He's gonna crumble. Oh god. I'm thinking... Just tell him about the storm. I, I think that the He'll storm literally just lose his everything mind. Everything started when I found out I could rewind time. There's no way this is just a coincidence, right? Max, not only the storm, but the eclipse, the birds, the whales, everything. 
All because... because of me? How? I'm not a real scientist, even though I play one at school, but this seems <laughs> like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. Huh. What happened with Jefferson? Did... did he hurt you? Um, he yes. He used Nathan to get drugs and money for him. Jefferson tied me up and dosed me with some drug and took sick photos of me. It was so horrible. Max, I'm so sorry you had to go through all that. You're the bravest person I've ever known. You know, I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Busted. History. Which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or, or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. Well, yeah. Even in the environment. You're my friend, Warren. You believe me, right? I, he seems to. I haven't told anybody else except for Chloe, and, and she can't help me right now. I know I can be a pain in the ass, and and you've always treated me like a person, not, not a beta nerd. I I told you before that I'll always believe you. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole, you're part of something bigger. Now, I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. How could there be a more important moment in history? And I'm in the middle of it with you? So thank you for trusting me. Man, okay, Thanks that's cool. Here. Always. I'll take that. Watch and observe, pal. You're about to have your mind implode. Hey. Be careful out there. Do it. Lay it on him. For luck. Just in case we don't get out of this, I wanted to say... I know, Lauren. Of course you do. <laughs> I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. That's why you're super max. Oh no. for this shit. Come on, Max. Okay, it's time to make some serious choices. Jesus, dude, what is up with you? Ooh. I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me, too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna Sorry, we were connected to Rachel. Let's go. Now. Chloe, wait. Listen. I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're going to die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk-ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. Okay, you're, right, you're going to need to chill right now. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, That's going to be tough to swallow. Teacher? That's bullshit! Nathan is the fucking serial killer! We saw the proof! Now excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Uh... Uh... God, I'm telling her. Nathan is dead, and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? 
How do you know that? Because I was there. You're just gonna have to you trust everything tell me I exactly say. Exactly what happened, please. Chloe, Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here, and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm, I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I. Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm going to do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is going to turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? Yeah, about that. What do you that. mean, Max? What did you do? I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but but you ended up in a car crash instead. Oh no, my so god. Much, you you were completely paralyzed. And you you were in pain. You were slowly dying and you you asked me to end your life. But Chloe there was no way I could do that. I had to return to this timeline to see you again. I had she to. She might not like this. Oh, Max. That must have been. That must have been awful for you. I, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and. I'm actually surprised at how she's I never handling this. Hurt you, ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's that's why you should come with me so we can stay together and stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He's not even at our house anymore. Yeah, again. Oh my god. I'm telling her. Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes. You got that you right. Are. Now let's go save so the world. Listen. In a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. Okay. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain oh, Jesus. that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Okay. Here we go. There's got to be a few paradoxes here. I wonder if there's any, like, loose ends. 